So this is a good hub. Imagine having a template and the speaker mesh together. However, the software is nothing like a template. So when, it, when it's icon like this, it just shows you your, just your photo library. Then when you swipe it, um, you've got home control over here. This way you control all your smart appliances in the house. Let's say lights. For instance, I'm on the living room. If I click here, it turns off all the lights in the living room. And yeah. Then when I come here where it says speakers and TVs, this way I can actually play music from any part of the house. Then rooms, this way you can actually control anything from each and every room. For instance, in my bedroom here, I've got blankets. Blanket says it's on here. I can switch off the blankets from here. And yeah, can turn on my geyser from here. You see bottom geyser. I can turn on my geyser here. Over here, you can actually play your YouTube uh, videos and your Spotify if you want to play Spotify. But also you can cast any Let's say you've got DSTV on your phone, you can cast it here and it's just going to play here. Or you've got Amazon Prime, you can cast your Amazon Prime here. Let's say you're in the kitchen, but you still want to watch a certain show. You can actually watch it from here. DSTV, Amazon, Netflix, everything, you can actually watch it from here. I've placed this on the kitchen because I can actually search for videos on how to actually cook something else. Google, play a video on how to make scrambled eggs. Eggs. I normally have three eggs. The last feature that I like using is the it's under communication here. Here you can actually call anyone who's got Google Geo. For instance, I can literally call my girlfriend from here. A voice call or video call, they say voice call. So yeah, basically this is just a home control for every smart thing that you have in your house. You can just control it from here.